Suit ideas. Gotta make sure mom doesn't see this. Man, Stevie is as old as a boiler. This move really hasn't sunk in yet. Still feels like a boiler's apartment. Not ours. Glad Genki's stay in a couple of weeks. Gonna be a lot of late nights working on spider gear. <laughs> Middle school graduation. Haven't seen these two in a while. See what Genki's working on. Oh, Speed Nonagon. Dude needs to finish so I can play it. <laughs> Pete took me to see this. He totally cried at the end. And so did I. Still gotta box up the last of Abuela's stuff and ship it to her in Puerto Rico. I invited a guest tonight. Can you get the apartment ready? Oh, um, uh, maybe put on some music, set the mood? Ah, oh, Naja. Really? Your campaign manager on Christmas Eve? Well, tomorrow's rally isn't going to plan itself. Thanks for getting the apartment ready, mijo. Hello? <laughs> okay, Naja, ya nos dieron el permiso para mañana. Is the mystery guest Uncle Aaron? Un segundo. You know I don't want him coming around here. I just thought... Never mind. Let's talk about it later, okay? Nadja, I'm back. What did you want me to do again? Put on some music, maybe light the tree. Thank you. Haha, aquí estoy. I shouldn't keep bugging Mom. Oye, espera hasta que llegue la hora de la cena, por favor. Yes, ma'am. ¿Él dijo qué? No, no, no te creo. Ese hombre está loco. Fifteen years in Brooklyn without a stain. Then we moved to Harlem. Might be a sign. ¿Cómo cuántos estamos esperando mañana? Glad Dad's tree survived the move. Oh. Me too. He loved that little guy. Ain't no Christmas like a Brooklyn Christmas. I miss hearing him say that. No, no lo creo. 
That view was a lot better before Rockstar moved in. I'm gonna make you proud, Dad. En serio? Wow. No puedo creer que en realidad estemos haciendo esto. Hmm. No records. Hey, Mom. Where's Dad's vinyl? Um, should be in my room. Thanks. Hmm. Hmm. Uh -huh. Pero legalmente, siempre y cuando mantengamos una distancia. And it looks okay, right? Roxon no podrá decir nada. Estamos bien. Yep, still works. Probably tripled my average shower count since I started this hero thing. Mom City Council run came together fast. People in Harlem really love her. Clean, guava, priceless heirloom. I didn't say it before. Thanks for inviting me to stay over break. Anytime, man. Your parents like in Hawaii? Before you got home, they called me from the top of Haleakala, so I'd say they're doing okay. I didn't want to miss Christmas in New York. You can't. It's the best time of the year. That's what I said. House B not a gun coming. I had a breakthrough about how to display the UI in a tiny window without overcrowding it. I think I could use it in other apps. Oh, that's so dope. Did I hear your mom say this used to be your grandma's apartment? Yeah, till she retired to Puerto Rico. Mom thought our place in Brooklyn felt empty with just the two of us, so here we are. Well, I'm glad you moved. Way closer to my place. Anybody online talking about the rhino fight? Yeah, and especially rocks on shills harping on the power outage. They say this is why we gotta upgrade the power grid with new form. Ugh, barf. So, those people at the plaza, did you find out what they're after? They were really interested in new form. I'm gonna look into it tomorrow. Man, it feels so good knowing we don't have school tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> Instead, we got a whole city to take care of while Spider-Man's away. I'd take that over physics class. Red stains, bleach, gloves, adult supervision. Guess mom's not done unpacking either. <laughs> that wallpaper just screams abuela. Mom ordered like a hundred of these because the article mentioned dad. Who is the Spider-Man? If only you knew, ma. And what's that? Huh. Must have gotten mixed up in the move. One of dad's old case files. Who's the prowler? I wonder if Dad ever caught the guy. I haven't looked through these since before City Hall. Dad's favorite album. He put this on every Sunday while he made coffee. Oh, <laughs> salsa from Abuela. Mom and Dad would move when this came on. I think this was Uncle Aaron's. Dad never played it, but he also never got rid of it. Bleached borax, uh, borax with bleach, boraxed bleach. Hey man, you guys have any regular bleach bleach? You sure bleach is a good idea? Yeah, for sure. Why? No reason. What's the pick, DJ? The greatest record ever. in a while. It was Uncle Aaron's. Oh, well, it's a great record. That doorbell's been broken for years. Miles, could you get that? Of course. 
How are your parents, Genki? I haven't talked to them in a while. They're good. They saw a sea turtle the size of a Labrador off Molokini yesterday. Wow, that's amazing. I'm glad you decided to stay in the city. It's fun having you in the house. It's good to be here, Miss Morales. So, one month later, glad you moved to Harlem? Back to Harlem for me. I grew up in this apartment. Miles is getting used to it, I think. You and your parents still live in Sugar Hill, right? Yes, ma'am. I'm glad you guys moved. I can get here in 20 minutes. It took me an hour to get to Brooklyn. <laughs> I'm happy we could cut down on your commute time. Miles, can you get the door? Yeah, just a sec, Mom. Finn? Hey, fixed your doorbell. <laughs> it's so good to see you. How are you? It's been like... Months. A lot's changed. Yeah, it really has. Is that our guest of honor? Come on in, you two. Dinner's almost ready. Finn, I'm so glad you could make it. Thanks for inviting me, Miss Morales. <laughs> we missed you. Well, this one especially. <laughs> uh, hi. Finn, this is Genki, my friend from Brooklyn Visions Academy. Genki, this is Finn, my best friend. <laughs> my other best friend. <laughs> Oh, yeah. You guys won the middle school science fair at County, right? You made a, uh... Energy, energy converter? converter? Jinx! <laughs> oh. uh. The wiring in this building is such a mess. I'll check the circuit breaker. Gracias. So, Christmas by candlelight? I promise I didn't break it when I fixed your doorbell. I hadn't considered that. <laughs> it would be kind of impressive if you managed to knock out power to the whole building. Impressive in the worst way. Maybe impressive's the wrong word. Uh, memorable? There you go. We need to do something about the food. I have hot plates somewhere, the kind with batteries. Did we unpack them yet? How long is that food gonna hold out with no heat? Uh, not that long. Miles, did you check the breaker? I'm on it. I could start a bonfire in the living room. Ooh, we could make s'mores. Not on the restored hardwood, we couldn't. I'm sorry about this, Finn. First time you're seeing our new place, and it's not making a great impression. It's a beautiful apartment, even in the dark. So, I've known Miles a while now. Why haven't we met before? <laughs> you get straight to the point, huh? It's one of my charms. Miles and I haven't seen each other in a while. I guess he's been busy. So have I. See, that's what I love about the holidays. Brings people together. Yeah, I guess you're right. You need help checking the breaker? Nah, I got it. Okay, so you're like a science genius. Have you ever made mobile apps? No, I'm more into engineering. Electrical science, that kind of thing. Bioelectricity? Yeah, that sounds interesting. Why? Uh, I, uh, no, no reason. How did you and Miles meet, Genki? Freshman roommates at Visions. Miles was like a lost baby bird. I had to take him under my wing. <laughs> Very generous of you. <laughs> Your turn, Finn. How did you meet Miles? Kindergarten. One day during recess, we took apart one of the school's vacuum cleaners so we could figure out how it works. Best friends ever since. Yes, I remember that call from your teacher. Paid off in the end. Robotics club, science fairs. Which definitely wouldn't have happened without the sacrifice of the brave little vacuum cleaner. Gone, but not forgotten. Hey, what about that old guy from the shelter? Is he coming tonight? Old guy? Peter Parker. A friend Miles knows from volunteering at Feast. A friend who is 24. Right, 24. Old. <sighs> No, Peter isn't coming. Miles said he's in Europe with his girlfriend for a few weeks. European vacation, definitely old. Is it harder to campaign in a special election? Most people don't plan to hit the polls in January. Mm, yes and no. We aren't fighting for airspace, but we have to make sure people know where and when to vote. If you need help, I'm happy to phone bank. I might take you up on that. 
part of me likes blackouts. Reminds me of camping with my mom. You know, I've never actually been camping. Me neither. My mom thought it was a sin that we couldn't see the stars from Harlem. So every summer, we spent three days in the woods. Nothing but our wits and our backpacks, she said. That sounds really nice. It was. It really was. Also kind of scary. <laughs> Sometimes it was that, too. No good. Breaker doesn't have power. Looks like the whole block's out. Let me check if I can see anything from the fire escape. Okay, honey, but be safe. Definitely can't get to the transformer from here. Unless you're super sticky. Really hope no one can see me up here. Which rock sound react with no problem? I don't know. Don't look out the window. Don't look out the window. Is it kidding you out having any luck outside? I hope so. Hot plates are only going to get us so far in salvaging this dinner. Bioelectricity can take down Rhino. But can it save Christmas dinner? I... Come on. It worked. Man, those lights are bright. Did not think this through. Gotta get back inside ASAP. Keep them distracted, Genki. Come on, Genki. Is Miles still outside? Actually, oh. uh, what about a photo? <laughs> right now? Yeah, you know, precious moments. You gotta capture them. Shouldn't we wait for Miles? No, he hates photos. <laughs> All right, everyone squeeze in. Ready? Great photo, great photo. Oh, hey, Miles. Uh, who's ready to eat? You guys sit down. I got this. Mm, smells good. Mm. Finn, tell us everything you've been up to. You still in robotics club? I had to quit, but I've been studying biotech on my own. Nerd. Oh, says the guy who has to wear an ascot to school. <laughs> hey, only on Tuesdays. <laughs> Does your brother Rick still work for Roxon? I don't know how anyone could work there after seeing your last campaign ad. You went for Simon Krieger's jugular. <laughs> that reminds me. Genki, you have a certain flair for social media. Could you spread the word about tomorrow's rally? Yeah, we'll be trending by midnight. <sighs> Sometimes it feels like Simon Krieger's my real opponent. Roxon has so much influence here, but they don't answer to anyone except their shareholders. Harlem needs someone to fight for the community. That's Mom's campaign speech voice, in case you couldn't tell. <laughs> uh, you want to proofread these before I post them? Yes! Do not hit send! <gasps> <laughs> so, so, what's going on with you? What do you mean? You seem... I don't know. Distracted. Want to talk about it? Not tonight. It's Christmas. Hey, how are you handling the move from Brooklyn? I mean, it's fine. 
Ugh. You hate it. No. Nah. That's your, I hate it, but I'm too nice to say it voice. No, it's, I don't know anybody here, and I'm always having to ask for directions. You need to find a good restaurant, a barber shop, somewhere you can shoot hoops. You'll settle in. What if we hang out tomorrow? Just the two of us. You're not too busy? It's winter break. I can put off homework for at least another week. Okay, I'll text you. It's a date. I, I mean, n not a date, uh, you know, a, a friend date. Still as smooth as the last time I saw you. <laughs> <laughs> Miles. What? You awake? No. So I stayed up last night and designed an app for your new suit. Thing's got a crazy custom OS, nothing I've ever seen before. But I ran it through a disassembler so I could reverse engineer the plugin architecture and... Uh... You just fell asleep again, didn't you? Miles! I'm up. I'm up. It's almost done compiling. Oh, thank you. Ready to try out my app? Yeah, man. Let's do this. I'm connected to your analytics. Let's test drive this baby. All right. Everything you see, how are you not puking all the time? Lots of practice. 